Hey, whoa! <laughs> hey, hi. I was just about to cite you for a movie violation. Sorry, you know, me and my magazines, and once I get to work, I don't really have any time. Oh, you're headed to the studio? Yeah, it's a nice day. I thought I would walk. Yeah, same here. Mind if I join you? It's on my way. Sure. So, how is everything? Oh, everything's great now. Thanks to you. Things are great, thanks to me. What did I do? Well, I'm taking a page from your book. I'm trying to be more patient with Carly. I'm letting her send the kids to camp. That's great. I know. Yeah, that'll be good for them and take the pressure off of you. Yeah, a little bit. I thought so. Then she announces this morning that she's reopening Metro by herself and that my help is not needed. And that's a problem because... Well, it's, it's a huge thing to do, especially by yourself and when you don't have any experience and you got three kids at home. So the patience is short-lived. No. No, you see, I think it's a mistake, but it's hers to make, so I backed off. Patience intact. Thanks to you. You know what, Jack? I am I'm really glad that you're figuring things out. I am. But from now on, I really don't think I want to hear about your problems with your ex-wife. Whoa, hold on a second. I'm sorry if I upset you. I'm not upset. Uh-huh. I'm just, I, you know... I have a lot on my plate right now, and you and your marital or ex-marital problems don't really make the cut, sorry. You and Brad having problems? No, what? Why would you ask that? Well, because you're making it sound like having a teenage stepdaughter sprung on you is no big deal at all, when in actuality, I think it is. No, we're dealing with it together, as it should be. So, you deal with your problems, I'll deal with mine. I thought we were friends. We are. We are. It's just that my marriage is private, and if you can't handle that... No, I can. I can, I can handle it. Good. Okay, cool. So, from now on, we are friends with boundaries. Strict boundaries. Our past is confusing enough without bringing it up all the time. That's not what I was trying to do, okay? Okay, well, good. From now on, if you have problems with Carly, talk to her about it, not me. And don't ask me about Brad. Okay. You know, I forgot I have to pick something up before I get to work.